Challenge Rift 329 in Europe and this time we have the Crusader and the time to beat is 6 minutes and 20 and this is I think pretty easy to do yeah it seems like a long time and we will see how this goes so let's take a look on the build itself first um this is again an legacy of dreams build that means we have no set items we have yeah a lot of random legendaries yeah that boost damage and so on and we're gonna make use of it yeah we have also not that high legendary gems yeah legacy of dreams is only 25 we have the yeah toxin gem on rank 40 and we have the yeah Molten Wild Beast Gizzard on 25 as well. Um, let's take a look on the abilities. Yeah, we have Slash with uh, Rune Zeal. We have Fist of the Heavens, Divine Well. We have Shield Glare, Uncertainty, Judgment Resolved, Heaven's Fury, Ascendancy, Steed Charge, Draw and Quarter. And for the passives, we use Holy Cause, Fanatism. Fanaticism, fanaticism, fanaticism. This is amazing. And finery and heavenly strands. So what I used to do here usually is um, readjust my talents. Yeah, you just press S and then you shift click the abilities. I have the horse on two uh, and judgment I put on three and heaven's fury on four. And this way it feels more comfortable to use the abilities. Let's take a look on the follower. Um, he has all skills, which is pretty nice. And uh, he has a lot of strengths. Probably I should do this too on my follower, equipping Guardians aversion to, to exploit the strengths here. Um, yeah, but let's jump right into the challenge rift. Um, Act 3 map, I use my horse here immediately. Um, the doors are a little bit uh, uh, frustrating. Um, you want to go down here like first yeah like you want to turn left to the south because otherwise you are on a, in a dead end there's a pack up there but uh, you will lose a lot of time and it's not worth it then you just spam right click here yeah taking the pylon not that important to take the pylon but you see what the what the issue is here right um it's a very linear build yeah it's not like we can skip anything really really fast so you have to make use of your of your horse as much as possible and once you're through the doors it's pretty easy so there's another pack here um second floor i try to hoard first a little bit Probably not worth it in this time here, in this run. But this is usually what I do. Try to use my fists of heavens uh, on on yeah when there are a lot of mobs gathered, or obviously during the packs. Um, trying to generate also when I can, but uh, yeah, it's a little bit difficult. Um, the big ones here that I just killed, they are also worth it. So whenever you see like huge mobs, you want to kill them as well because they give a lot of progress. Um, here now you want to go to the left as well. There's another yellow pack. That is pretty quick. And now I want to yeah, load my bar again, my resources, uh, my wrath, that I'm full, more or less. Because here this pack I want to do from range. Otherwise, we have the problem with the molten. Um, you can also save your horse for this one, but uh, yeah, this time I couldn't. Then we have floor number three already. Trying to kill this pack as well. Get this last orb. So don't worry too much about the time here. Uh, I already did a few runs, so I'm like three minutes ahead of the of the original timer, so it shouldn't be a problem for you. 
So you see the build is also not super tanky, but it is relatively tanky, so you don't have to worry that much about um, being squishy or dying a lot. Usually you wanna, if you can, you wanna finish here, but if it doesn't work out, then just go to the next floor and there's a pack at the start immediately, but this costs a lot of time. Like the best case scenario, you have finished here. Otherwise you lose a lot of time. Yeah. So you see it here. We'll probably do another run that we can improve. Um, there we go, a lot more. Uh, he hits pretty hard. For this I also use uh, Judgment and uh, Heaven's Fury. So what was his time? I think like 340-ish. 341, yeah. So let's take a look into the leaderboards. Yeah, my best time was 323, but you see this is definitely enough to, to finish this challenge rift easily, yeah. This is still in the morning, like not many people have done this and let's do one more run perhaps we can improve this time uh probably you don't want to use it too early here the the horse no it's it's all right i guess so here we go this way uh going down and the stuff that is on the way using the horse one more time and then killing the pack here as quick as possible. Running to the pylon. Using horse, using this. Using this. Another pack. Yeah, this dies quick. Another horse. Uh, probably better to just one shot it with the last tick of the of the pylon pack I mean so here's the blue now that's cost me a lot of time. to load up my bar again, like my wrath resources. And same again. So now we want to keep our horse. was a bit unfortunate but it's okay uh, we don't lose that much time here mm. yeah kind of kind of trapped here when the mobs are in the way but looks good so far I really want to finish on this floor here. If we can manage this, that would be great. Trying to board a little bit here. Yeah, this was perfect. I think we can do it. Now yeah, only 1% left. Not a new best time, but uh, I think this was this was already. Ah, it was a new best time. It is green, 3.23, but it wasn't much better than the one I had. Let's take a look. Yeah. Just, just, I don't know. 
a few a few milliseconds faster than the, my previous run. I don't want to try much more because uh, yeah, this is this is enough to to finish it, and I think uh, this gives you enough uh, to get through this. And yeah, hope you enjoyed this one. If you have any questions, then leave them in the comments. And otherwise, see you guys soon. Bye bye.